Hello everyone, welcome to Formula Story. In this video, I'll be discussing how to attempt the DILR section in a mock cat. So let's begin. Now for the DILR section, whenever you see a set, before looking at the paragraph given, look at the questions. If the questions are not of direct type, that is, if the question requires you to form cases or possibilities that do not solve them in the first round. If the questions are of direct type, example, if the question is, what is the color of Ram's shirt? Then read the paragraph of that set and then once you are done reading, decide whether to attempt it or not. Suppose you decide to attempt a particular set and then after maximum of 5 minutes, you should know if you are going in the right direction or not. And if even after spending 5 minutes, you are not sure whether you will be able to crack that set or not, then leave it and move on to the next set. See, one thing that you need to realize is that Never get so much involved or engrossed in a set that you forget to keep a sense of time. Moreover, do not just get scared looking at the length of the questions. Just get an overview of what a particular set deals with and then decide whether to go for it or not. Now out of 8 sets of DILR, 4 of them will be of medium difficulty level and you, you'll have to find those first and solve them. Solve those 4 sets say within 30 to 35 minutes and then once you know that I have attempted 16 questions successfully, your brain will be a bit composed and even the tough sets which are left now can be solved in a really easy manner and without much of stress. Moreover, it is not absolutely necessary to solve each and every question of a set. In many cases, especially in DI, there will be a question somewhere in between which are extremely tough. Beware of such questions. These are put in place to derail your momentum. So two important things to remember, keep a sense of time and selection of questions. These two aspects will help you to move from the 97 to the 99.xx percentile. So that's it people. I've made a video for the verbal section and I'll be making another one for the quant section. And if you want to read whatever I've said in the whole video, you can visit the link in the description box. So I will come up with more interesting videos till then do like my video and subscribe to my channel and also post your valuable feedback so that I can improve at my upcoming videos. Thank you.